All right, so next we're gonna look at setting up an account with Google Analytics. Google Analytics is a free tool to track website traffic on your site. Um, visitors, where they came from, what content they looked at, all that kind of stuff. It won't really matter early on. Um, as you get more traffic, this will become more important, but when you do, you'll wish you had the old traffic so you can start seeing how things grow. So it's worth going ahead and setting it now and just letting it sit for a while and you can get back to it later. But it's wise to go and set it up from day one so you can start tracking that data. So. If you go to analytics.google.com and sign in with any Google account, it could be a Gmail account, could be any other Google account, you can set it for free. So we'll set up an account here, name it. Um, it gets a little weird with accounts versus properties and some of that, but just call it the name of your site. So we'll call it blogging course. Um, go next. And the property name, again, so you can have an account if you had a big company and then multiple websites, but we'll just keep it simple. We'll do the same thing. So blogging course. All right, we'll go next and then just choose a few categories here. So this would be, I'm not even sure what it would be. We'll call it hobbies and leisure here. Small, I want to measure customer engagement and that's probably about good enough. So we'll create. You have to agree to a couple more terms of GDPR related stuff, but I accept all that. And then do you want emails and stuff from them? Probably worth getting, so save that. That's up to you. All right, and we're set up. So. Um, as we go further, you'll be able to see a bit more about how this works, but really there's a lot of other um, classes and YouTube videos and things you can take for how to use analytics. We really want to get it set up. So now you have an account, remember how you log in with it, and I'm going to show you in the next video how to get connected to your site so your site will have the code on it to start tracking that data.